my equestrian friends, it's me, Lisa, the Budget Equestrian. Welcome back to another video. Ethan says hello, by the way. And I really meant to get this video out on Thursday last week, but that didn't happen because I've been really busy painting my house. I don't know if you've ever tried to paint an exterior of a house, a two-story house, but it's a lot of work. And we're almost done. We've got a little bit more to go, but thankfully the house painting project is just about done, which is awesome. Now all we have to do is fix the deck and get that all taken care of. And then the outside of the house is done. But back to what I wanted to share with you guys today. So for the first time ever, I placed an order on horselovers.com. And if you've never heard of them, they have a whole bunch of different English, Western training stuff. And I got an email from them and said, hey, you know, if you place an order, you'll save like 15% off of your total order. So I was like, that's really cool. So I went over and checked out their website and they had a lot of neat stuff and they had some really good deals on some things. And I was like, if they're 15% off on top of what their prices already are, this is fantastic. Unfortunately, when I went to check out and enter my promo code, they wouldn't honor it. They said, you're already getting a great deal, so we can't give you this promo code on top of it, which I thought was a little lame. And I really did want the things that were in my shopping carts. So I just said, okay, I don't get the discount, but I'll get my stuff. And this is what I got from Horse Lovers. Now, I placed my order with them on June 11th. It is now June 29th when I am recording this. It took a long time for them to ship me my stuff. But again, I guess I'm just used to places like Jeffers and Riding Warehouse where I get my stuff shipped super fast. I guess it's not their fault that they don't have amazing shipping like Jeffers and Riding Warehouse. Okay, I'm done complaining about the shipping and the promo codes for horse lovers. Let's see what I got. Okay, oh, it's tied. No, there's a clip in it. So the first thing I got was this shirt by Ariat. I think it's pretty, I like it. And it has a price tag on it of $49.95 and they had it at Horse Lovers for $19.95. So that was a really good deal. It's a cute shirt. I'm really excited to wear that. Not bad, an Ariat shirt that's normally $50. I got it for 20. I like it. So they did send a coupon. It says, thank you, try us again and get $5 off your next order. I don't know if I'll try them again, we'll see, but I'm afraid if I do try to use this thank you coupon, they'll tell me, oh, sorry, you can't use it on the stuff you bought. So we'll see. That's a lot of stuff packaged in there. This is so cute. Look at that, that's nice. Okay, so this is the next thing I got and this is an ear bonnet in burgundy. And the reason I got this was to hopefully match the burgundy saddle pad that I got for free from Dover Saddlery. And it looks like it'll fit both Frisbee and Ethan, so that's a good thing. And the ear bonnet was $9.12, so that was a really good deal. And here is a really cute ear bonnet. This is by Lamisel, Lamisel, am I saying that right? And this is an ear bonnet that is kind of a mesh, so it's a lot lighter, and that's why I got it for the summertime when it's hot out, so that it's not too hot on the horses. And this was $12.55. So again, a good price for a nice ear bonnet. And next, I bought a bunch more hay nets. These are the Shires hay nets. It's the slow feed, so the holes are one inch wide, and it works really well for my horses. But I bought four more of them, so filling up these four hay nets will be one day's worth of food for my horses. And it just makes it a lot easier for me, especially during the week when I have to go to work. If I have a bunch of hay nets already filled, like the night before or whatever, it makes it a lot easier just to grab a hay net and go. And Horse Lovers actually had a really good price on them. They were $12.59 for each of the Shires hay nets. That was a good deal. 
These are actually cute. This was kind of an impulse purchase. These are a pair of tall boot socks. They're by Tough Rider. They have a fun pattern and they're really stretchy. That's nice. They're not super heavy, but they're not super light like the Zocks, boot socks are. And these were only 99 cents, so that was a really good deal. And this is cute. This is a short sleeve shirt by Outback. And this was also $19.99, like the Ariat shirt. But it's really cute. It's lightweight. I think that'll look okay. I like blue. That's really pretty. And next I got some replacement tines and ends for my wave fork. I really, really like my wave fork. I have it in blue and black right now. But unfortunately, when I was opening up the door to my little red barn, I inadvertently got it caught on my wave fork. So now the little pieces won't stay together all the way. So I figured I might as well go ahead and buy a new one. And it's lightning really bad. That was scary. I think we're gonna go in. Okay, the lighting was getting a little close. So I decided to come back into the tack room just a little bit to finish off my unboxing for you guys. That's scary, I don't like lightning. All right, so what I was talking about before I was interrupted by the lightning is I got some new replacement tines and the rail for my wave fork because I broke the other one, unfortunately. But I've had my wave fork for a long time. It's been at least five years and the tines have lasted this long and they probably would have lasted longer, but because of my stupidity, I figured let's just go ahead and get some new tines. So I got black and purple because I really like those colors. And it's really easy to assemble. I basically needed the end pieces because that's what I bent, but I have an extra rail now just in case. And the tines come in a pack of seven, so I got black and purple, and those were $10.59 per bag. And then the rail portion of it was $12.95. So about $35 for the tines and a new rail rack, but it's worth it, it really is. Way better than any manure fork I've ever used. So now I've got a new one basically. Then I found this really cute, really soft little rubber face brush and they sent it in purple. I'm so happy they did that. It's really soft, it's $2.61 and I thought my horses would really like that on their faces. So I got a new little face brush. And then I got a couple of Uncle Jimmy's licky thing these are in candy apple flavor, and my horses really like this a lot. So I have it hanging in their stall, kind of like a treat for them. And I try to keep it so that they can't like push the treat hanger into the wall, because if they do, then they'll just sit there and eat this all in one sitting. But if I can keep the treat hanger so it moves around a little bit, these last a lot longer. And they had a really good price on these. They were $6.29 a piece which is way less expensive than if I were to go to Dover's or Murdoch's or Big R and buy them. So that was a really good deal. Okay, so when I first got my packages from Horse Lovers, I was a little disappointed in how long it took for me to get my order. But after I opened it and looked at everything, I'm really happy with the things that I got and they really did have great deals. So. In the end, I am really happy with the things that I bought from Horse Lovers. Will I order from them again? Probably in the future. There really isn't anything that I need right now, for the most part, but I can always find something else that I wanna buy. But for now, I think I'm pretty good. I've got hay nets, I've got a couple more ear bonnets, I've got some cute shirts, and I can fix my wave fork. So I think I'm doing pretty good. So shipping issues and promo code issues aside, I was really happy with the things that I got. So if you haven't checked out Horse Lovers, you should probably give them a try, see what they have. You might find something that you really like. Just be patient in the time it takes you to get your package. But otherwise, I think you'd be really happy with their prices. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video. I'd love it if you'd subscribe to my channel. Just click on my picture, me and Frisbee, down in the corner. You can subscribe to my channel and watch all the other DIY and horse product review videos I have showing you how to make the most of the time that you have with your horse. Again, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.